Hello and welcome to YouTube's favorite variety channel. Today we're ripping packs once again. We got a, a variety of things. Panini 88 stickers, 06 Allen and Ginter, 2022 Chrome, 23 Series 1, and 24 Series 1. I'm going to set these off to the side. I'm going to start with these. I actually had no intention of ripping these packs. So when I opened, or when I picked up the uh, box that they were in, I noticed the glue is all starting to come undone. It Like it won't hold itself shut anymore so we may as well go ahead and enjoy these oh there's some garbage mike marshall harold reynolds nice bob james trying to get i can't quite make out all right so we're gonna have to do some research on that 88 why would they do that to us so we'll have to look that up and pete and cavalier and caviglia Moving on. See, okay. So they're all coming apart except for that one. It's too hard to open. The Minnesota sticker. Jim Rice. Dave Parker. Gary Pettis. Piece of a puzzle. It's obviously Yankee. Of course, it doesn't tell us what's going on there. And Pat Sheridan. So these are just fun. I remember getting these. Actually, I don't know if it was the stickers that I remember so much. We had like sticker albums. Maybe that's what these were for. Yeah, they are called album stickers. I, I vaguely remember that from when I was a kid. And I also remember Tops had mini cards. Oh, there we go. So Baltimore. What's up, Greg Olson? Here's Will Clark. Jack Howell. And Oberkfell. Don't recall that name at all, which is weird because I, I like different names. Rafael Ramirez and Edwin Correa. So these are fun. They're a good warm up for uh, the stuff we're about to see. Oh, more garbage. Walt Terrell. Jeffrey Mumphrey. Check out the lettuce on this dude. Or is that? That might not be his lettuce. That could just be a stain on the card. Kevin Seitzer. BJ Surhoff, Larry Sheets. Nice. So that one's empty, that one's empty. Wait a minute. All right, I'm going to have to go. I don't remember opening four, but apparently we did. I thought we had one left. Oops, sorry about that. So that was fun. Let's do, we'll hold off on that Allen and Ginter. In fact, that'll be the grand finale if you just want to zip ahead right to that. I don't blame you. So 2022 Chrome, got our sleeves ready to go. Mike, Gavin Sheets, Mark Kazov. Yo, all right. So hold on. It's like a Polish name, and I've never seen a name that ends in A-R-Y. That's from Europe. Oh, and Dave Stewart. Nice. Pack number two. I don't have as much to say today as uh, you might remember from my last rip video. It's been a long, long work day. Vlad Guerrero, Big Daddy, Chris Bassett, John Heasley, Billy Williams. Now we're going to sleeve up that. I always forget to sleeve up until one comes along and I say, oh, you know, I'll sleeve that. And then I don't sleeve the rest. People get offended. Why don't you sleeve my favorite player? Your favorite player is a bum, probably. Oh, what's up with that? Is it static? Not sure. That's not a great condition card anyway. No. Glare is not great condition either. But I think what, what I'm seeing is the residue from the pack falling apart. Mondesi. Dale Murphy. Nice. Shane Boz. Larry Doby. Nice. We had these. I'm not much of a packs guy in general. Definitely not a chrome packs guy. I'm not going to drop that kind of loot. Pick them up when I see them cheap. But yeah, usually I would just buy chrome individually. So I'm not used to seeing all these little splotches. I'm not even sure if that's normal or not. Moving on. 
You know what? Maybe we'll just do one more chrome and save the, the rest for the next time we do a, a potluck opening. Not the most exciting rip. Aparicio, Nathaniel Lowe. Oh, Tay Oscar. Nice. He's crushing it in Los Angeles right now. And Kevin Smith. So let's go ahead and sleeve up that Tay Oscar card. I'm sure I'm going to get somebody. Oh, you're not crushing it there. You're the, on a slump. What a bum. They're all bums. All right. You know what I'm saying. All right. So, mm, all right. We'll do one more chrome and we'll save the rest. I did see that Vado on the back. Bryce Elder. Juan Yepes. Casey Mize. And Joey Vado. We'll sleep up, Joey. Your rates. With that suave. That doesn't even look like a baseball card. It looks like your fucking Tinder profile, bro. What are you doing? All right, so he's off to the side. We'll do uh, 2023. Liam Hendricks. Jeff Springs. Paul Quint. Cal Quantrill. Got the uh, first syllable in each of his names backwards. Yadi Hernandez. Greg Soto. Chicago Cubs. That's a really cool card. If you're watching these, you've probably seen most of these cards already. I've never seen any of them. I took like a 30-year hiatus, so pretty much everything prior to uh, Series 1 2024 is going to be new and exciting to me. Texas Rangers. This is what I, I do not like. I never liked landscape cards except for Score Bo Jackson. I almost thought that was a soccer team here for a minute. So are, are these all going to be like this? Darren Ruff. This is already getting annoying. And the Atlanta Braves, okay. We're done with uh, landscape pictures. Now we can go back to Salvador Perez, Tyrone Taylor, Trevor Rogers, Gomery. Uh oh. Sean Murphy, good Irishman. Bad corner. Jacob DeGrom. That's a point. Stars of the MLB, Nolan, Nolan Gorman and Francisco Lindor. Let's leave that up and give that to my nephew. Alex Wood, Jonah Bride, Card Flip, Pavin Smith, Jake Cronenworth. Tell me which part of that I said wrong. I threw in an extra TH somewhere. Server, oh, Shohei, nice. PC. Liberator, Corbin Burns, Josiah Gray, Dylan Cease. Shane McClanahan, Zach Thompson, Chris Bryant, not bad. Tanner Rainey, Bobby Witt Jr., rookie. And Aaron Ashby, all-star rookie, not rookie rookie. Still pretty pumped. So we'll put those there. Let's leave these up real quick. I'll, I'll fast forward it so you don't have to listen to me try to stumble into a conversation while I do this. But buy three, get one free. The link to my eBay store will be in the description. I don't sell uh, typically just loose raw cards on Kiln.net, but like always, if you see something on my eBay store, you're like, hey, I like that. We're all, you know, we're off by a couple bucks. I'll just take it down and sell it off of Kiln.net. I can save you money and I won't have to pay the fees. So it, it works out for everybody. But eBay gets more eyes. So that's where most of my stuff is. Luciano, Matt Manning. If you're watching my Olympic open era card opening the other day, you saw me get excited about a dude named Pat Manning who lived up the road. He was an Olympic rower, no, no relation. I mean, maybe relation, but not direct relation. Ryan Jeffers, Andrew Abbott, Tyler Anderson, Cole Raggins, Christian Betancourt, Brendan White, Reed Detmers, Brad Keller, Harold Ramirez, Grant Hartwig, J-Rod, Maurice Dubian, Donovan, Robertson, Self Freelich, what, you know, I don't get a lot of, like, NL West or NL Central stuff. I watch East Coast News and West Coast News, so I get a lot of Yankees, Mets, Dodgers, and Anaheim. No ESPN, so I really have no idea who guys who I thought were going to be exciting, but you don't hear about them blowing the, the stitches off of a ball every day. Johan Rojas, Jake Rogers, J.P. Crawford, Luke Baker, Patrick Wisdom. Another Johan Rojas, Blue Parallel. Jason Dominguez. Okay. 
He Crow Armstrong. Was oh, that the Chrome one? Hold on. No. That throws me off how sometimes there are uh, Chrome in the Series 1 just for the stars of the MLB, though. So it seems. Miles Mikolas, Keaton Wynn, Andrew Vaughn, Alec Bohm. He had a good time at the All Star game. Just <laughs> see him try to hold back his laughter. Aaron Judge. Um, Yankees, but Judge there. Jose Ramirez. O'Neill Cruz also having a pretty stellar performance. Bobby Miller. Okay. So that brings us to my friends. One, 2006. Allen and Ginter. I wanted the pack specifically because I wanted a Mike Tyson card that was in this pack or in this set. So what ended up happening was I got this at, still at a pretty good deal. But then just after I bought this, I found the exact Mike Tyson card I wanted at a very good deal. So I bought that also. So if there's one in here, then I'll have two. All right. It's not on the back. Good. We want that Tyson card to be dead center. Oh, but Thomas Edison, that could be interesting. Who's this? Robert E. Lee. Very interesting. Jack Wilson. Danny Baez. Johnny Pesky. Oops. I don't understand. This feels like an insert. This is just an advertisement for rip cards. And there's Thomas Edison. So we got Robert E. Lee and Thomas Edison, but let's, I don't understand what's going on here. It doesn't feel, I've only held one or two rip packs before, but why would the only card in here that's like 60 point just be for an advertisement? Sequentially numbered, randomly inserted in packs. Yeah, and there's no, so this isn't anything. That's annoying as piss. Why would they, why would they put this in here? Maybe I'll send it off to PSA. Give those guys a chuckle. Anyway, so that's that. It was a fun hodgepodge. Nothing real exciting, but let's see what we did get from the stack. Bobby Miller Future, O'Neill Cruz, Alec Bohm, Pete Crow Armstrong, Stars, Jazz Chisholm Jr. Stars, Jason Dominguez, Rojas with the Retail Parallel Rookie, Sal Frillick, and J-Rod. All in all, I had a good time. I hope you did too. It's always time well spent when my friends are around. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, good jokes and bad jokes, leave those down in the uh, whatever's down there at the bottom. And if you wanted any of these cards or want to talk about them, that's fine too. Drop that in there. It doesn't have to be uh, advice or questions. But that's going to do it. If you keep watching another five seconds, you are going to see an end screen that suggests you should watch some more things. I suggest you do that too. That's why I made that end screen. Peace.